And the third race spaces are on the track and pretty to the post. These are Stallions and Gelding, claimers, racing one mile. The five horse has been scratched. Field of eight remain, the one brave new world, owned by Tim Humrick of Miamisburg, Steve Owens, the trainer driver. The two is going national, owned by Brad Hanners, Brandy Duncan of Washington Courthouse, Chuck Grubbs trains, Ryan Holson getting the call. Three J.B. Zell Sid, laced and trained by Ron Barker of Chillicothe, Rick Jordan up. The four, Ralph Bird, owned by Kathy Haynes of Sterling, Walter Haynes trains, Dean Gillespie drives. The five, Scratch. Number six, Country George, owned by the Rents Davis Stable of Dayton, Robert Rents trains, handled by Jack Daly. Number seven, Porky's Revenge, owned and trained by Alex Spence Jr. of Grove City, Dave Hawkup. The eight, Espo, owned and trained by Chanterbury of London, Darren Mauser in the bike. And the nine, Warm Image, owned by Thomas Cummins of Solana, Roy Murphy trains, Donovan Jr. is in the sulky. Win play show perfecta and is super facta wagering nine minutes now until post time, nine minutes. Third race, pacing stallions and gildings, lining up moving in. On the back stretch, approaching the start. And uh, they're off, and it's Espo first from the outside, going hard for the lead. Warm image alongside, getting away second. Going national towards the inside is third. From the middle of the track, fourth, Country George. To the inside in five, it's J.B. Zelsid around the first turn. Along the rail in sixth, it's Brave New World. At the rail in seventh, Ralph Bird. The trailer eighth is Porky's Revenge. But Espo calling the shots early here. He again leads to the first quarter of the opening panel in 27 and 3. On the inside, Warm Image at 45 to 1. Irvine again has a long shot in position here. He's racing second. Going national at the rail, gapping a third. And he's about five lengths up on J.B. Zell Sid. Here comes Ralph Bird now moving first up at the outside of fifth. At the rail in sixth, it's Country George from off the back end. Warm Image. Make that a Porky's Revenge now with live cover flow is underway. And that shuffles Brave New World towards the back end. He now trails the half in 58 and 4. To the back stretch, and it's Espo cruising along here comfortably. Length and a half, but now to the outside. Going national is going after that leader. Warm Image is at the rail. Out of the outside, racing a fourth, it's Ralph Bird advancing up the rail five. J.B. Zell Sid and swinging three wide now. Here comes Porky's Revenge as Hawk sends along his way. Porky's Revenge is three deep on the outside. Was sixth now, fifth now, fourth and coming on. But it's Espo drawing clear here on the front. He's extended that lead now three at the three quarters, 128 and two. And Espo by two and a half, three lengths. Warm Image is still there. A close second and going national at the rail. J.B. Zell Sid angles to the outside as they turn for home now. Last set and eighth and down the stretch. And it's Espo with the lead here and as he's flying his tail waving goodbye here Espo opens up some five a battle here for place on the outside JB Zell said getting up late over warm image and going national And here is the winner of the third race, number eight, Espo, a 10-year-old son of Beam Ziegel from the Columbia George Mare, Georgia trip owned, trained by Chanterbury of London, Darren Mauser in the Sonki. Espo scoring his seventh of the season, a gate-to-wire effort tonight, facing the mile and 158. Third race, order finish, top to bottom, Brave New World, eight. Going national four, J.B. Zell said two. Ralph Bird, six. The five was Scratch. Country George, seven. Porky's Revenge, five. Espo, the winner, and Warm Image, three.